Don, let's show everyone just how deep the tag team division is in TNA. The NYC's, the New York Connection, Glenn Gilberti and Johnny Swinger, while they may not look the part these days, you cannot deny the in-ring ability of the two. The reformation of Triple X, the former NWA World Tag Team Champions, has been greatly anticipated, and it adds to the excitement of the tag team division. For months, Irish Pat Kenny and Sonny Siaki were on the receiving end of the NYC's acts of humiliation. But Kenny and Siaki ended up having the last laugh. Three Live Crew's support for the truth has been unwavering. And just like Ron Killing's quest for the world title, Conan and BG James are looking to regain the tag team titles. Scott Demore may have assembled the most complete team in TNA. Team Canada, size, power, and speed. They bring everything to the table. Teams from all over the world are looking to make a name in TNA. Japan's Miyamoto and Nasawa add to the international flavor of the tag division. America's most wanted, the best tag team in TNA today. Everyone's gunning for the four-time NWA World's Tag Team Champions, James Storm and Chris Harris. Team Mexico's success in the America's X Cup competition established them as a force to be reckoned with and a team that the TNA fans have adopted. Raven's challenge to Sabu brought him together with Sanjay Dutt. Their similar heritage really cements their bond as a top team in TNA. And this video package just illustrates the depth of the tag division. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is a non-title grudge match about to make their way to the ring. They are the team of Andy Douglas and Chase Stevens. They are the Naturals! TNA management made a decision to put Chase Stevens and Andy Douglas on the gut checklist earlier this month, and it certainly lit a fire under the Naturals to avoid being on the bubble for a warrior spot. They sent a message to the TNA front office and the wrestlers. They stole the personal ring gear of the NWA Tag Champs AMW, and the thieves continue to flaunt that stolen property as they wear it to the ring. And their opponents, they are the current NWA World Tag Team Champions. They are the team of Cowboy James Storm and Wildcat Chris Harris. They are America's Most Wanted. And here they come. Harris and Storm hit the ring, and they're in revenge mode. We're underway. Be careful what you wish for. using that lipstick that they smeared on AMW. Finally, the illegal interference that cost them a matchup on Impact last week, and the best tag team in TNA, they're going for revenge, and they got it. Oh, Wildcat just ripping his own jacket off of Andy Douglas right there, and just, oh, man, kicks him right into the ramp. And check out Storm. Storm's got Chase Stevens going to try and elevate him for a suplex, but perfectly placed knee. Oh, even right for into the rail. Just tossed him head first right into the steel. Oh, I'll tell you right now, Chase Stevens and Andy Douglas, they asked for this. They goaded, taunted, and done everything they could to get noticed. Well, they're noticed, all right. They're in the ring right there with America's Most Wanted, and there's not even any gold on the line. They I'm it. telling you, it's just a grudge. They double team move by AMW, catapult into the clothesline as they have their way with Chase Stevens. Oh, duck that front clothesline. Never saw the one from the back coming. Oh, you like that, Chase? Oh, look at this. As you can see right here, it's about a pin right there. Hardly. <laughs> can you imagine the picked up frustration that America's most wanted is dealt with and had to live with watching somebody else wearing your outfits? And they are getting their revenge, and they're getting their payback tonight. Another double team move by AMW. Yeah, he's Chase Stevens. That's five on the receiving end of his own tag team partner. They took Andy Douglas and used him as a weapon, tossing him into Stevens. Oh, my gosh. I'm telling you right now, America's most wanted. Fired up the crowd behind him, and the Naturals never stood a chance.
great video package just prior to this matchup, illustrating the incredible depth of the tag team picture here in TNA. That time is, oh man, great move by the Naturals. Chris Harris momentarily playing to the crowd. Looked like he was going to try and suplex Stevens in. He his puck from behind, and now this matchup swings 180 in the favor of the Naturals. Well, you mentioned all the great tag teams. It was just so unbelievable how this division has gone and how many people are wanting to get involved in it right now. Chase Stevens right here. Andy Douglas showing their teamwork, something that they do very well. And have got it, have got Wildcat Chris Harris stuck right there in the middle, and they're giving it to him. Stevens, repeated shots. First to the ribcage area, then to the head. The tag is in two. His tag team partner Andy Douglas and the Naturals double team on the Wildcat. Well, they're going to have to do, they're going to have to have the most incredible teamwork that they've ever had at this point. I mean, this is a situation where to beat America's Most Wanted, you have to be at your best. Not just your best, you've got to be at the very best you've ever been. And right now, as you see right here, Andy Douglas just giving it to the Wildcat, Chris Harrison. Taunting him, raking him with the fingers, raking, poking him in the eyes, just doing every little dirty trick in the book. Good teamwork by the Naturals. Good quick tags. Think about this larger area that the wrestlers have to work with in the six-sided ring. As you see the big ring exchange with the southpaw, the left hand of the Wildcat getting the better of it. Quick reverse. Harris shot off into the ropes. Stops. Oh, wow. Man. Put on the brakes and then unleashed a lethal lariat. What a clothesline by Harris. Oh, man, that just, you can see his head snap back right there. Jay Stevens looking, he can even, even knows where he is right now. Well, obviously, he's trying to find Andy Douglas. He knows he has to make a tag with the smart move. The same thing for the Wildcat. Tag is in, and the Tennessee Cowboys is on fire. Oh, look at him. He's just revved up right here, but again, Numbers he's got, game. He got the two-on-one situation, and uh-oh, can he skin the cat? Right he's still the ring comes James Storm. Oh, and there he goes. Right back out goes Douglas. He tries to skin the cat as well, but Storm was prepared. One step ahead. Caught him with the drop kick. Off the knife edge top. Quick reverse. James Storm sent off into the ropes. Oh, beautiful by James Storm as he catches it perfectly. Tilt a whirl, head scissors for Stevens. Slingshot into the crossbody block for Andy Douglas. Oh, James Storm just. Oh, oh. super kick. Super kick on target. Pin attempt. Here's two. Wait, wait a minute. Oh. Douglas pulled senior official Rudy Charles out to the floor. Getting word that, that backstage NWA director of authority Vince Russo. Look at this stunt. X Division stars everywhere. X Division wrestlers all pleading their case to Vince Russo, all lining up for that potential X Division title shot later tonight against the phenomenal AJ Styles. Kid Cash suspended, still waiting word from Russo as to who it's going to be that gets the title shot. And wow, it looked like there were about five or six wrestlers trying to plead their case to Russo. Well, you heard AJ Styles. You know, they saw what happened last time. They saw how the crowd reacted when Jeff Hardy came out and took the challenge. Well, you saw those guys. They obviously want to be a part of it. But Andy Douglas and Chase Stevens got control through all that on Cowboy James Storm and him. They just pulled him out at one point, caught his head right on the end of the mat. And he has just not been the same since, and they're dominating him right now, Mike. You can see the blatant chokehold from Andy Douglas. Storm tries to get back up to his feet, but he's not able to. Just neutralizing the Tennessee Cowboy in mid-ring at this point. You know, Don, the longer this matchup goes, with each minute, I become more impressed with the job that Chase Stevens and Andy Douglas, the Naturals, are doing in this grudge match. Oh, I'll be honest with you, I would have taken the under at this point as far as how long they would have lasted in this ring. And, and, and I'm going to be honest with you, not only are they hanging in there, they may be fighting dirty, but they show that their, their cohesiveness as a team is just, is really kind of impressive. Harris just can't take it anymore. He sees that his tag team partner, Storm, was being double teamed by the Naturals. Tries to get in, tries to break it up, but referee Rudy Charles will have none of that. Sends him right back out to the apron. I'll tell you what, I, I almost, if you look right now, it's... it's Snap suplex, pin attempt, no, just a two count. What's going to be going through America's Most Wanted's mind right here? I mean, they came out with all the aggression, they had all the momentum, and these guys haven't flinched. You know, I'm just guessing that in the minds of AMW, just like in our minds with, with 
each succeeding minute. As the matchup continues, as the matchup progresses, they have to wonder about the Naturals as well because obviously Stevens and Douglas have really turned up their game tonight. Oh, and they're feeding off the crowd. The fact that the crowd is so against them, they're using it, and they're using it, and they're letting it build the momentum in them. As you see right there, Chase Stevens just grinding the Cowboy James Storm. And Wildcat okay, Chris Harris trying to get in, and again, looking right there with the referee now looking. Andy Douglas takes advantage of it, just pulling his head on the ropes, pulling the wind out of him. Oh, they're so good at taking advantage when the referee's distracted. Well, they really are, yeah. I, I guess you have to give the Devils their due, but they really have turned this matchup around. Backbreaker as he drops Storm across the knee. Now, Chase Stevens headed out to the ring apron. Gonna try and mount the corner turnbuckles. Going up to the top. James Storm's gotta get a tag here right now because he is absolutely in no shape to be in that ring. Glancing blow off the top, follow cover. He didn't really hit him flush, no. and as a result, Storm was able to get out of two. Yeah, he was able to barely get out of the way just enough to where it didn't hit him straight on because that would have ended it. Now, Andy Douglas gonna go up and see if he can't do it. Watch his teamwork. Missed. Great teamwork by the Naturals. I'm telling you, we, we, we kind of slammed him. Oh, great move though by Storm as Douglas took just too long. Caught him with that right hand, doubled him over with the blow to the midsection. Now he's got to get Harris in. Again, it's the six-sided ring. It confuses them a lot of times when, they, when they've you know, been hit so many times. Great kick to White Storm. He gets the tag. hot tag. And now the Wildcat is going to get some more of that payback. Oh, Andy Douglas. Oh, check it out. See what he just did to Chase Stevens? Just picked him up by the head, flung him back into the ring. Brought him right back in by the head. Oh, the power of the Wildcat. Full Nelson takes him down. Going to elevate Stevens up. Full Nelson slammed by Harris on Stevens. Oh, my gosh. This thing is just absolutely turned right now in the favor of America's most wanted. It's the Wildcat had seen enough, and he's dishing it out. Exacting revenge for AMW. The high vertical holding him in place. And Stevens crashes down to the mat. Oh, man, as the crowd goes absolutely crazy as Wildcat Chris Harris showing why he was almost the NWA World Heavyweight Champion they, at one point. They love AMW here at the TNA Asylum. Firmly earn their support of Harrison Storm as they go to gain revenge. Watch the double team move. Oh, that's the teamwork. Heart attack, I move, pin attempt, two. No. no. Stevens, get out of the mat! Wildcat can't believe it. He's looking at Rudy Charles like, you've got to be kidding yeah, me. I, I'm as surprised as the Wildcat Chris Harris is. Wait a minute, Douglas uh, takes Harris out. Oh, took him out to the floor and just flung him head first right into the steel ring post. I'll tell you what, the respect that the Naturals are earning, not only from us, I think even from the crowd, the fact that they've hung in there this long. Watch the Tennessee Cowboys. Oh, here it is. He's got Douglas. Yes! He's down. Here's the cover. Here's the pin. Thought AMW had him again. I'll tell you what, these Naturals are relentless. They, there's just no, there's no give up in no the Naturals. No quit at all. They're taking everything that AMW can give them, and I'll tell you what, it's... Oh, wait a minute, what's going on now? Is Rudy Charles... Oh, that's okay, wind wild him up. Here Put comes the catatonic. Here it comes. Oh, Stevens got out of it. Stevens reversed and countered the catatonic. Flown over by Harris. Quick roll up. He's got pass. him. Uh oh. oh Douglas breaks it up. Two, wait a minute. Three, Stevens, one, two. two. Did he get it? No. Yeah. The Nationals win. No. The winners of the match. The Natural. You gotta be kidding. Oh my gosh! And you can see him. You can't believe it. As they grab the gear. He did. Well, I don't they know, Don. Do you think they AMW, do you, they, they, over, they may have just overlooked the Naturals and they, you, you talk about taking advantage of a situation, they do it again. 